This is just sad. I mean, at this point, who is actually supporting Joe Biden? It is a pathetic campaign, and it is representative of what they want to do to this country, how they want to control this country, how they want to control what everyone is doing, how they want everyone to stay apart, how they want there to be a lack of enthusiasm. Look at this right here. This is today. This is today. Look at this. This is the future of the United States of America under Joe Biden and Kamala Harris. This is nonsense right here. That is the most embarrassing thing. Like, they want you to be in your little circle. They want you to, you know, keep your voice to a minimum. I mean, this is pathetic. This is absolutely pathetic. And then you go to a Trump rally where I just was just a few days ago. Thousands and thousands of people, enthusiasm, excitement, and, you know, energy and passion and you know, positivity moving forward for this country and, and what we're trying to do as individuals. And, and here you have this nonsense right here. This is absolutely pathetic. This is absolutely ridiculous and unforgivable. And the fact that there are people still out here supporting this nonsense is just unbelievable to me. Um, I don't feel bad for Joe Biden, even though Joe Biden should not be in the position he's in. It's the Democrats and it's his family that are just marching him out there. Uh, this dude needs to be, you know, in a home or in his own home taken care of. And he's out there making gaffes. He doesn't know where he's at half the time. And the Democrats get what they deserve in this situation. They've spent the last four years whining and crying about Trump and creating every single scenario to try to uh, attach him to something bad. And the reality of it is he's been the greatest president of our lifetime. And they're just an embarrassment at this point in time. And it, this is pathetic. So uh, every day, something more embarrassing happens for the Biden campaign, whether it's Kamala Harris uh, laughing nervously when she's faced with uh, any type of question that isn't a softball. Um Joe Biden with his gaffe machine of uh, his uh, rallies, he will not answer questions. It, it is a joke. It is a complete and total shit show. Uh, either way, you guys have a great day. Vote Trump in 2020. Vote in person. And we will talk to you later.